yet as corporations, we, we rely on the information, the self-assessment information provided by our vendors and our system integrators, which is a huge problem because in that situation, you're going to get green status reports and they create a false sense of security. That's not true. And I'm not saying everything needs to be yellow and red and the sky is falling and it's doomsday scenario from day one. You need to identify those risks before you feel them, before they become obvious to you. And what we view with our clients and the way we look at it is we want to be the ones to help them see around the corner what's coming next before they run into it. If you run into it, it's too late usually by the time you get to the problem or by the time the, the problem materializes to the point where you see it and feel it. If you are anywhere in your digital transformation journey, right now. And I mean, anywhere, if you're on day zero, if you're just a few weeks, a few months into it, or if you're just about to start your digital transformation, if you haven't identified risks and issues and started to see some signs of yellow and maybe even some signs, some signs of red, there's something you're missing. You're not seeing the full picture. You're not seeing below the tip of the iceberg right now. And so there's going to be risks and issues. That is not, that's not really a debatable fact. In my opinion, you are, you are going to have risks and issues no matter who you are, no matter what vendor or partners you're working with, you're going to have risks and issues no matter who you hire. The question is how quickly do you recognize them? How do you prioritize them and how do you mitigate them?